We find that spring, but first... I'd like to swing by one of the radio towers under the Army's control east of here. Huh? What do you want to do at a radio tower? I have a message that I'd like as many people as possible to hear. And the radio equipment there will let me broadcast what I have to say nationwide.
Tanks. This is far too many troops to be defending such a remote location. Were they expecting us? Seems their commander's no stranger to war. attacks. Bring them down one by one. Yep. General Are, the tank squadron at the checkpoint has been decimated. They what? General Shiva's tank took them out and continued on. Round up all the soldiers in the area, and hunt them down! Prince, see the radio tower on top of that hill? That's our target. This'll be a piece of cake. Don't get cocky just yet. The army must be aware of our general location. They're sure to reinforce their defenses in the area. to the army's radio tower sits well with me. Is it really worth taking a risk like that? Can't say. Maybe I've let my ego get the better of me. It's fine. Let when the terrain's to your disadvantage, keep moving until you're in a better spot. <laughs> I wouldn't stop if you asked me to. Brigade at the checkpoint. All gone, sir. What? So, the legend lives on. But why would he bother going somewhere so remote? Maybe he's heading for our water source to the south. That's it. The radio tower. He wants to make a broadcast. Signalmen, alert all units near the news radio tower via encrypted transmission. On the double! Sir! All vehicles, advance east!
the truth and what's been on my mind. I've got a bad feeling about this. Royal Army soldiers all over Sandland? There's even a bunch near our village. Most of them are stationed near the Royal Capital. It can be a lot more hit and miss the farther you get away from them. You'll also see supply units traveling around as they transport goods to bases. Those are probably the ones who pass near our village. Hey, Raoul! We've been spotted! There's more than I expected. Hold up! Looks like they've got us surrounded. An ambush? What do we do? We're sitting ducks out here! Watch your rear! Biel's thief! You ready for this? It's like you have to ask. How many times must I tell you to address him as Prince Beelzebub? Dang, it's busted. Looks like they disabled it in advance to keep us from using it. They read us like a book. This commander's a pro. So you're saying this was all for nothing? No, I think we can get it fixed. Just need the right materials. We can use this to find out about the area. If we can get it fixed up, that is. We can repair it. Just need materials. News office? This is Shiva. 
I have something I want to tell the people of this country, if you'll let me transmit it. Yes. Right away, please. We have just received radio contact from a man claiming to be General Shiva himself. What? He has a message for you all, and while we have not been able to confirm his identity, we have agreed to transmit his words live on air, beginning now. This is Shiva. First, allow me to sincerely apologize to you all for any distress I may have caused. All units, cut the engines! Make it quiet! I freely confess to the crime of stealing a tank. But unlike what you were told previously, I have not attacked any villages with it. I swear this on my life. It is not my aim to spread panic and confusion amid this country. I intend only to find a legendary spring, which I assure you is no mere fairy tale. For this country cannot withstand any more drought! The spring? Did he say spring? What is he even talking about? So please, just allow me to finish this mission without interference. When I find the spring, I promise to make its location public and return the tank I stole. That is all. Actually, I have one final message for a certain person on an entirely different subject. Though this doesn't absolve my role in causing that explosion 30 years ago, I've learned the truth behind it. Commander Zeyu, you are the only one I will never forgive. Over and out. Mr. Shiva, a question if you were... Uh... I'm afraid he's cut the line. <laughs> Contact the news office immediately! Tell them that they are never to allow that criminal to speak freely on air again! This is bad, isn't it, Zayu? He said something about the truth behind that explosion! Uh, and then there's that spring he said he's looking for. D do you think what he's really referring to is our secret water source? Oh, this is bad. Very, very bad. I'm sorry for dragging you two into this. All right, let's keep heading south. Uh, Supreme Commander Zeo, sir. Yes, sir. 
I believe General Shiva is very close. He is no general. A mere ghost requires no title. Don't even try to capture him alive! Kill him! Once and for all! That's an order! Uh, forgive me, but might I ask you just one thing, Supreme Commander? What Jet... Shiva said about the truth behind that explosion. What exactly do you think he meant by that? You see, my own father was killed in that explosion, so... You fool! There is absolutely nothing of the sort! Shiva is only trying to rattle us! Hurry up and get rid of him already! My apologies! Papa? He said he's looking for a spring. You don't! Don't fall for it! He's just pretending to be some selfless goody two-shoes! You can't trust people like that! Though if there's one thing we can agree on, it's that Zeo's a damn rat! All right! Come on, Guppy! Fire one shot right at the midpoint between Shiva and the Royal Army! Got it, Papa! It's Shiva! All tanks, prepare for battle! Enemy tank brigade! They're close by! W what? Prepare to engage! Hurry! Prince, take cover behind the rocks, and swing around in the other direction to attack them! Good! Keep at it! That's the stuff! Right like that must have been a piece of cake for you, Prince. <laughs> I know! Pretty badass, huh? Hold on. That was way too easy. Their commander's probably still... Commander! As long as their commander still stands, this battle won't end! Take him out! Keep circling around him, stay behind cover! What? I've heard a rumor about you! That you're searching for a water source for Sandland's people! Is it true? Yeah, it's the truth! The King's water is too expensive for most people to even afford the bare minimum to survive. So I promised my villains that I would find a legendary spring. And they pooled the little money they had to send me off. And do you truly believe that such a spring exists? Of course I do. But something doesn't add up about the King's water. There's no secret there, huh? <laughs> Unbelievable. He's superhuman. He, he saw through our tactics and completely disabled our unit with zero loss of life. He's exactly the man my father said he was. I can't hope to compete. He's on a whole different plane.
I'm afraid I can't tell you about the spring, and despite not answering your question, I have one for you. On the radio, you mentioned the truth behind the explosion 30 years ago. What is it? You may not want to hear it. I believe it, but I've got no hard proof. I am Are, the son of a Poe, one of your very own officers. Please, tell me. I need to know the truth of my father's death. A Poe's son, eh? I see. V Thief, you're our source. He should hear it from you. You've got to be. Must I do everything around here? Hold on! Don't tell me you heard this story from him! You take the word of a demon?! If you won't listen to what he has to say, I can't force you. But let me say this. In this whole twisted world, I haven't met anyone as honest as these two. I trust them far, far more than any human, at least. Would you let prejudice blind you to the truth? Just like how our fear and suspicion of the Peachy caused this terrible tragedy. The Peachy? What do you mean by that? Papa! The guys from the army look like they're surrendering! Ugh! Bunch of spineless cowards! But at least they're all together in one spot with Beelzebub. Now's our chance. Guppy! Turn every last one of them into fertilizer with that cannon of yours! That bounty's as good as ours! <laughs> Damn it! Wha what was that just now? A cannon? No. Don't tell me there was another tank! No. It came from somewhere above us. I'll hop up high and look around. It's the swimmers! Those little... Beelzebub spotted us! <laughs> Dang it! They got away again! I'm gonna pulverize them next time! That Beelzebub just saved our lives. Perhaps it's true that we've misjudged the demons. All right, I'll hear it. Tell me- Nope, not till I hear the magic word. Why, you little imp! Who do you think you're- Silence, you! Please, just tell me! Please! Blah, all right, enough. Listen up. That's... that's impossible. No. Surely that can't be true. I know Commander Zayu is a cold man, but I can't believe he could be so inhuman. Well, we've said our piece. And sorry, but it looks like we'll have to borrow the tank a bit longer. Sir, are you sure? Should we really be letting Shiva go like this? What do you mean by that? We never had him to begin with. What? We almost did, until the swimmers struck out of nowhere, that is. They took out our tanks, then fled. That is what happened, isn't it? Sir, yes sir! Now... I guess I should make my report to Supreme Commander Zeyu. No. There's something I have to confirm with the King first. Okay. Now we can finally start heading south again. <laughs>